click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends. In this video, we are going to derive the condition for the maximum number of orders that are available in a grating. The grating equation is A plus B into sine of theta is equal to n lambda, wherein n is equal to 0, 1, 2, 3, so on and so forth. Lambda is the wavelength that is incident on the diffraction grating, theta is the angle of diffraction and A plus B one can say is nothing but D which is the distance between one opaque and one transparent ruling in the grating. So with this we now wish to find out what is the maximum order that is available in a grating. The maximum order will be available or it will be observable at the point theta is equal to 90. So let us consider that this is the grating and this is 0 over here theta is equal to 0. So the maximum order will actually be available over here hypothetically if your theta is equal to 90 degrees. Hence substituting 90 over there you obtain that your A plus B into sine 90 is equal to n into lambda. Sine 90 of course is 1 and hence your n, I am going to be specific over here, maximum order is equal to a plus b divided by, so this is the maximum order that is available in a grating. So this is an expression for the maximum order that can be observed in a grating. And what is the grating element in this case? The grating element normally we say it is 1 upon a plus b, right? So 1 upon a plus b is actually the grating element. a plus b is, so this is the distance between the opaque part over here and this is the distance between the transparent part of the grating. And your D is actually equal to A plus B. So you can write this down as N max is equal to A plus B upon lambda equal to D upon lambda. Thus, if you know the D for a particular grating and if you know the incident wavelength lambda, you will be able to find out what is the maximum order which is observable for that particular diffraction grating which is simply the ratio of d upon lambda. Sincere thanks students for watching this particular video. Stay tuned to Ikeda and do subscribe to our channel Ikeda. Thanks a lot.